how you feel about us people. Yeah. Okay, hold on, wait, wait. Let me introduce the channel first. And then we can talk. Yeah. Yes. With my friend. Mm. See my friend here? Yeah, man. Bow them, bow them, bow. It's just beautiful. <laughs> anyway, hello guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Aisha May here. If you know me, hi. If you don't know me, welcome. Um, I'm here with my friend Babu, and we're just going to have a conversation about the different cultures that are here because I find it really fascinating. And yes, I don't know before everyone on their high horse starts coming in. How come you don't know? Listen, let me explain first of all why I don't know. My dad came to the UK when he was 13 and from the pressures of trying to fit in in the, the culture of the culture within the UK, he then lost a lot of his own culture. Not only that, his parents both died when he was a very young age um, and his parents were both quite older so he doesn't have his grandparents either. So therefore, he doesn't know a lot of things or has forgotten a lot of things. So therefore, I don't know these things. So please don't come at me when I say I don't know about these cultures or anything. Like, because I could test on certain things that you don't know in the UK. So, huh. anyway, <laughs> disclaimer. Anyway, so, yeah, we were just having a conversation. And sorry about the noise. I'm, um, I'm on site, by the way. Um, we were just having a conversation about the different cultures and I just find it really fascinating so I thought Barbara would be good to explain like the different ones you I think you were saying are the eight most affluent yeah ones in the Gambia yeah eight, eight, eight tribes eight tribes so what are they yeah you yeah. have you might have to speak a bit louder, by the way. You yeah, have uh, uh, Wandinka. Wandinka. Wolof. Wolof. Serapule. Fula. Fula. Manjago. Manjago. I've never heard of Manjago. Oh, Manjago. Jola. Jola. Seril. Seril. Aku. Aku. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And I did hear there's um, Bamba, Bambara. Yeah, Bambara. Um, as well. Oh, cool. I'm Aku. So can you tell me anything about Aku? Yeah, Aku people. Yeah. Because I know there's one thing I do know about Aku people. Apparently they're um, seen as the teachers, if that's correct. Yeah, good teachers, good learners. Yeah, because, but it's not for a positive reason, I don't feel. It's because we were mainly the ones taught by the slave within the slave kind of era. Is that right? No, they learn very early. Very early. Uh, and different, and different, and before, you know, like in the Muslims, Muslim, in the, in the, in the Muslim side, mostly, you know, 75% of Gambia. Yeah. Muslim. Yeah. You know? And before, most of our grandfathers mm -hmm. were not uh, So, the Aku people. Yeah. You know, they have, uh, like, they have Muslim people, mm -hmm. but they, are, they have majority Christian people. Yeah. So, they very easily to learn English. Uh, okay. They are grand grandfathers. We're teaching them. Teaching them. Uh, they don't deny. They just take it straight away. I see. So, so it it is still to do with like colonization. Yeah, it's yeah. part of the colonization. You know, yeah. As far as we colonize by English or French. Yeah. Learning English or French. Oh, so okay. Any country. Oh, okay. Um, well, sorry, go on. But before our grandfathers, they don't see it like that. 
that's why it's take longer time. You know? That's why they, uh, they, 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 they catch up very early. Yeah. In the, 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 uh, the country they came from, mostly Ghana. Yeah. No? Oh, Ghana. I heard Nigeria. No. So I could potentially, I have ancestry in Ghana then? Oh. Mostly their grand, their ancestors came from there. Oh, I see. I didn't know that. Yeah. Oh, okay. No, oh, okay. Yeah, because I think where I heard in Nigeria got was actually in the Banjo Museum. But maybe that part isn't correct then. Body. You know, in the museum in Banjo, mm. yeah, there it had. It said some Aku tribes came from Nigeria. Yeah, could be. Yeah, maybe as well. But also that makes a lot That's of sense. What I know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's interesting though, because also it makes a lot of sense because here um, I learned that my dad's name is not seen as a full name. Because his first name is Abdul and his last name is Rahman. But here in Gambia, it's seen as one whole name with two names. So they're supposed to be a last name. But from talking to you, you told me that because some of the Akus were initially Christian, then they changed to Muslim. Not everyone, but some. So that's why that might have been like, so they didn't change their name. Yeah, you yeah. change your name, but the surname name yeah. still have to be there. Still say, yeah. So that's why. Mm. Let's talk about your culture. What's your culture? Mine. Yeah. My culture is Oh, it's important, man. Someone is calling, bum. No. <laughs> no, I'm not. 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 <laughs> just so hanging around. <laughs> we'll pause for your phone call. Yeah, so sorry, what was your tribe again? I forgot. Oh, no, Aisha, sorry. I've learned here as well that because in the UK, I don't know if it's just me, but I know within the system it's kind of seen the same tribe and that's not the correct terminology as culture. So I need to even ingrain that in my mind. So sorry. Yeah, what's your culture again? Yeah, Sere. Sere, sorry, I forgot. Sere. And tell me about Sere people. Sere people. Yeah. You like Jere. Huh? You like Jere, you know? Jere? Mm. Oh, what, the food? Yeah, that's the food. Is that the one where it's, it's white, but it's got like kind of, not brown, but it's mixed with something? Is it that no, one? It's like kus. It's like kus, kus. Oh, I haven't had that one. Kus, kus? It's like couscous, but it's not couscous. Oh, okay. What do you mix it with? Yeah, they cook it with sauce. Yeah. What sauce? Anyone? Yeah, you can make it with milk. Yeah. I had this! Yeah? And you can have it sweet, too. Yeah, you can put like, sugar there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We used to eat it all the time with the cream. Yeah, with the yeah. cream. Yeah! I didn't know that was from, from your culture. Yeah. I'll see if I can find a picture and I'll put it up. That's really nice. We used to, even in the UK, we used to have it all the time. Yeah. Yeah. yeah oh. and, in, and in Gambia, my tribe, we are the most smallest tribe. Really? Oh, wow. Do you know where you guys originated from? Or were you just always in Gambia? So they originated, yeah, I think, I think they are originated. Senegal. Oh, so yeah, so you're just next door then. Oh, okay. And what um what are you guys best known for? Yeah, fishing. Oh, yeah, fish nice. Fisherman. Fisherman. Yeah. Can you fish? Yeah, really? No, I don't believe you. Yeah, <laughs> really? Yeah. You go to this year and catch for you for that one. I don't know, I don't trust you in China, bro. <laughs> oh, ladies fish. <laughs> oh, whatever. Oh, catfish. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't believe you. You yeah. can for real. Of course. So you could you could genuinely teach me. Yeah. How to cut You're not fish. joking. I can't no, trust no, no, you because no, no, no. you got your glasses on. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, we go to this year, I'll show you. Okay. Mm -hmm. I would actually like to go, but the only thing is, those boats, they're so small and I'm scared. Because <laughs> are they small, like, you know, like when we went to um, Kunta Kente? Kunta Kente. And we went on that boat. Yeah. Is it small like that? Yeah, or smaller? Same, same boat. You have, uh, small, oh. you have smaller, you have like that size. You that one two. is okay. Yeah, no problem. You take that one. But but we need more than two people because when <laughs> one is standing, then it will move. <laughs> no, I'm the captain, so don't worry. I'm the captain. I'm scared. I'm the captain. Don't worry. Okay. 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 So, what is the most um, what's it called? What what's the biggest tribe? Uh, let me see. I think I know it before you tell me. Mandinka. Yeah. Yeah. Some they say Mandinka, some say Fulani. I think it's Mandinka. Mandinka. That's what people can say. Oh, uh, yeah, because I've heard that, yeah, from some other people as well, actually. Oh, uh, okay. And do you know what they're famous for or known for? Politics. Politics. Oh, okay. Right, yeah, we'll be talking about politics. <laughs> <laughs> Oh wow, okay. And, and good learners too. That's why they like Yeah, that's what I was thinking. That's why they like to hold positions. Yes, yeah, yeah. That's what I was thinking as well. Yeah. The first president is Matika. Oh for real? Well, who's that? The first president of Kambia, Sadaka. What's his name? Sir Dauda Kerabaja. I can't say it louder. Sir Sa Dauda Dauda Kerabha Kerabha Jawa. 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 Jawara. Oh, okay, cool. Oh, okay. So that's interesting to know. So Mandinka is a name for politics. And what is their traditional food? Traditional food. Mm. Yeah, their traditional food here is uh, Durango. Durango? Durango. That's what Durango. I like from Mandinka. Oh, see, there's so much food I haven't very had. Local food and very nice. Yeah. Very spicy. Oh, I like spicy, especially since I moved back. Rangha. Rangha. Yeah. yeah, 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 I know Rangha. That's, um, it's they call, it, they call it Dura. Yeah, we love that. Dura, it's very nice. Yeah, it's the leaves, isn't it? When they mix the leaves yeah. and they put it together. Yeah. And you can have that with Benachin as well, the, the Rangha. Yes, the yeah. Rangha, yes. Yeah. Have it, it's separate. Yeah, yeah. Different guy, you can put it in different kind of food. Yeah, because is it like something that you have with food rather than you eat by itself? Yeah, yeah people, that's what I think. Yeah, for the one they call Rangha, mm -hmm. uh -huh. they put the white rice, oh. they cook dry white rice with that. Oh, I didn't the know. They make it, make it, make it a shoe. Oh. So that's what they use that with that. Oh, it sounds nice. I haven't had it like that. That's what, that's what we call that. Oh. Very nice. Okay. Oh, Babu, you have to tell me of some of the lots of different foods. What Do you know what other food? Okay, let me say what foods I have had. And then you can tell me what foods maybe I haven't had. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, so I've had obviously super kanja, mm -hmm. benachin, fish and chicken benachin. Um, I've had um, uh, chicken pepper soup. Fish stew, um, chicken chicken stew, chicken yasa. Um, what else have I had? Um, fufu. No. Never tried fufu. No. Your father's tried. I know. Is that is that what it's for? Are you joking? Yeah, of course. That's their favorite fufu. Well, I've never had it before. No, you have to have it. I know, I want to have it. Mm -hmm. I want to try it. Yeah, go to the, the, the apple one there. Where? In, in, in the road there, around Serapuna. Oh, okay. Around the Serapuna market. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's one apple, apple one there. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, 
and then make for you fufu. Mm. It's nice. Oh, I want to try it because I want to try it with super candle. Yes. Yeah. 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 Ah. Oh, okay. Okay. So what else is there that? Uh, what other dishes are there that are traditionally Gambian? Footy, that's the fullest. Oh, footy. Footy. No, no, never tried it. That's one originated from the fullest. Oh, oh, oh. Um, what about Afra? Is that Gambian? Afra. Yeah. One way. Oh. Just get your one, 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 one. Nice rum, or you know. Yeah. Just chuff, 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 chuff. <laughs> Afra is Afra is chicken, right? Yeah, chicken. You and have chicken Afra. You have um, meat. Uh, oh, uh, different meat. Afra. Afra. Or, you know, oh, okay. And, and it's, it's just the grill, yeah, yeah, in the grill. Yeah, I I have had Afra. My my dad's cousin used to have it at their house. They would do lamb Afra. Yeah. The lamb and then it has the the, the onion. Yeah. The sauce, isn't it? The sauce, yeah. Yeah. yeah when I used that. to eat eat red meat, I used to like it actually. Oh, so I have had Afra. Very nice. Oh, it is really nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I do like it. But in Gambia, we know we normally know it as the Mauritanian people. Oh, Mauritania. They make it as a business. They open a shop, send oh. a shop, people buy it. So if you want to buy it, after, mostly apart from these restaurants, local, you go to these Mauritanians. Yeah. Shops. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Okay, so to finish this video, I wanted to ask you, because I've been asked by people my subscribers they've asked me this question to ask fellow Gambian how do you feel about us diasporans coming here just just your just your just be honest <laughs> yeah yeah I don't have any problem with that I don't have any problem yeah and there is the smiling coast of Africa you know in there yeah, and we are very peaceful, you know. Mm. Yeah, and everybody is welcome as far as we are peaceful, mm -hmm. you know. Mm -hmm. No problem. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Because Gambia is for everyone. Yeah, it's yeah. For everyone, yeah. You know? Depending on whether you are white or black mm -hmm. you know? mm -hmm. or brown. Mm -hmm. Because, you know, yeah. we are all one. Yeah. yeah. One people. Yeah. 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 So that's what we believe. Gambians don't believe that this one is a diaspora or this one is there or this one. Yeah. We are all Gambians and we are all blacks. Mm. Yeah. And because of slavery, maybe that's why they became a diaspora. Mm -hmm. Now they're slavery, you know. Mm. There will be no diaspora. They will be home. Yeah, for real. So they will come home. Yeah. Yeah, this is home for everyone. Yeah. Yeah, man. Yeah. Gambia is home for everyone. Yeah, for real. Yeah, man. Yeah. Everybody want to smile. Yeah. Come to the coast. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> man. The coast of Africa. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, man. Oh, thank you for doing this with me. Yes, guys. I still need to do another one with you another day when you need to teach me some more of my language. Yeah, <laughs> you are my teacher. Yeah, you see, good teacher. No? Yes, man. Honestly, I need it. <clears throat> but anyway, thank you very much, as I said, and thank you guys for watching. So I hope you enjoyed this video, as I say all the time, and I'll see you in my next video. Nope.